Hi guys, so today I'm coming at you with the pet tag. I'm only going to do, um, I'm not going to have my my puppy in here. I have two cats also, which is Puss in Boots. It's the yellow cat y'all sometimes see roaming around my videos. And Mittens, which is the black and white cat I've had for going on three years, four years maybe? Four years now and I've had Mittens for a year. But anyway, this is about Lucky. Lucky, Lucky, Lucky. So, the first question is, what is your pet's name? And I just told you that. His name is Lucky. And if you want to know why his name is Lucky, originally, we had got a puppy name. We had got a, a Yorkie that we named Gizmo. Um, the day we went to go pick up Gizmo, Gizmo got sick in the car, and we took him back to the breeder. The breeder then took him to the vet, and he, they said that he had parvo, so he had to be put down. Um, once the breeder told us that, she took all her animals to get um, seen by the vet and every other animal um, all Gizmo's litter mates except two two other Yorkies 13 puppies in all had parvo so they all had to be put down and she told us we could um, get the boy that was left and that is how we got Lucky and that is why his name is Lucky because he's the luckiest puppy in all the world but anyway the next question is let's see what kind of breed, what breed is your animal? Um, he's a Yorkshire Terrier, which everyone calls Yorkies. Um, how long have you two been friends? We have been friends for, since, when have you been friends? When, how long have you been friends, Lucky? No, Lucky, no, nobody, no. We have been, um, we've had him since, he was born in March, and I think we got him around like April, so it'd be a year. Maybe had him like, in around April, I think. How do you how did you get your pet? We got our pet from a breeder in Kenston that my fiance's mom well my fiance knows and his mom knows. And she knows everybody because she's animal control up there. So yeah, don't give my mother in law no hard time up there. I have to come up there and regulate. But anyway, how old is your pet? He is almost a year old. He'll be a year old in like how old? Maybe like two two months, lucky? Two months? Um, what quirky things does your pet do? I don't really think he does anything quirky, per se, like, other than his jumping off the bed, he'll jump off the bed and then jump on the side of the bed, and he will sit there, and he'll bark and bark and bark until you jump off the bed, until you get off the bed, to get on the floor and play with him. Then he'll be happy. But if you don't do it, he will just keep jumping and jumping and jumping up and down. Which isn't really quirky, it's just annoying. It's very annoying. What other little things does he do? He has he has a very great relationship with with my yellow cat, um, mit, well Puss in Boots, because they're like they got a bromance going on. I don't I don't understand it, but like as soon as one wakes up, the other one wakes up and they're always playing together. They do everything together, like they sleep together. They really sleep together, like and the cat will hold him sometimes while they're sleeping. It's the funniest thing, like, seriously. Huh. What does a relationship, next question is, what does a relationship with your pet mean to you? Um, before I had Lucky, like, I was satisfied with my cat. Well, I more my cats, both cats. Um, but now that I have him, like, I can't imagine a day going by when he's not here like I actually get sad and stuff I'm getting sad right now just thinking about like one day he's going to die and I'm going to be about my little buddy and I don't even know what what we would do like my fiance my fiance would have it worse than me because this is his little buddy like I have videos where he's like my little buddy my little buddy he's just like cuddling up with his puppy and like he loves his puppy more than anything well not more than me because he's marrying me but he loves his little dog. And he would be like, I don't know. He's just like our little baby. He really is just like a baby to us until we make some babies. <laughs> yeah, so you saw my wink just now. Like, I can't wink. I can't wink at, like, well at all. And my sister always picks on me because I do, like, I have to do, like, this crazy face just to get a wink on. But, yeah. What are your pet's nicknames? Mm-hmm. Well, sometimes we call him Chewbacca because he looks like a little Chewbacca. Or, and then he looks like, um, what you call the other little things from Star Wars? Tag on it. I 
can't think of him, but I can't think of the other name. The Ewok. Ewok. He some he we call him Ewok sometimes. Um, call him annoying a lot because he he is very annoying because this puppy, this puppy craves attention. He wants your attention twenty four seven, all day long. Like every day, every time I'm about to go somewhere, like he will go. He would either lay on the couch and look sad and pitiful, or he would go in his cage and look sad and pitiful and wait for you to get there just looking sad. And he will look at you as you're walking out the door like, where are you going? Why are you leaving me? Like, it, like this puppy just needs, this puppy loves, loves, loves getting attention from anybody. And it's, it's even worse at night when you sleep because some, like, every night he gets in the bed. Like, we tried to keep him in the cage, but... In this new house, he just hates the cage. He just hates being in the cage. I don't know what it is about the cage in the house here. But, like, when we lived in an apartment, he was fine being in the cage. But now, you have to put him in the bed. And every night he gets in the bed, he jumps. He crawls. He crawls on top of us and scoops his little butt right in between us. Like, right in the middle. He finds a little hole in the covers and slits and slippers on down there. And lays in between us every night and if you try to move him he will growl at you because that, that is where he wants to be at and then another funny thing is like sometimes he'll pick he picks the people the person he wants to sleep with will sleep closer to and it's funny like my fiance had tried to move closer towards me and he'll push his little legs out trying to push my fiance away and it's just like it's so funny to me it really, really is funny, but yeah. So, you've met my buddy now, and yeah, that's that's about all for this one. So, see you guys soon. Say bye, Lucky.